Well, I have something else for you. Oh, please do. Show me what you got. And this is with the same idea as starting with the finished size. So you're, you are starting, if you want a three inch finished triangle, right. you start with three inches. You don't have to think about anything about seam allowances. Nothing zilch, zero. Okay. And with this system, you can make any kind of square, rectangle, anything that you want to with the system. Well, now what's this gizmo? It's called Finish Size Quilting from Guidelines for Quilting. Oh. First of all, he has his ruler, which okay. is great. This is my friend John Brady. And what you do is, is you take this guideline here and you put it along because I want the three so I put it along the three. And that just snapped on. It just snapped on and you can put it anywhere. And then you take these which are the little magic gizmos and you can see that it has a couple of ways that it's going to hold on. One is these little guys that are going to turn. So it's not going to slip around. Right. And it has a suction cup and so that's on there. Very secure. And there are different sizes, and they're all color-coded depending on what you're doing. So there's you don't get confused. Yes, there's one for half squares, one for quarter squares. So this is what you do then when you're cutting your fabric. All you have to do is you butt up that fabric guide right. against the raw edge, and you've already got your seam allowance taken care of, so you don't have to worry about that, and you just cut, and then that is your size that you start working with. That's your strip. And Super now you just cut clean. it and start doing everything that you would for making your rectangles.